a very much warm welcome to prophet zahid khan the heart of the god and the messiah of the all eternities we start our question and answer session today's transmission in few minutes thank you so much khuda ka salam ho adar aur un sab sunne walon par jin ke dil taras gaye khuda ko milne ke liye to main taiyar hu to dikh team jo kuch bhi madad kar rahe hain bahut bahut shukriya Uh, prophet zaid khan thank you so much uh, our first question of the day is what is the meaning of in enlightenment with god please describe about it thank you so much in enlightenment with god mean unification oneness with god second self of god harmony with god fulfilling the fulfill the purpose of life in which god put in human life and uh, enlightenment mean that you are representing as a mirror so god can see himself inside uh there can be many meaning perfection with god perfection in love that you will never leave god in any circumstances even heaven taken away from you even you are working in the hell whatever circumstances is your first love will be belong to god and last love will be belong to god anybody try to take those this love if it is a family friend children partner you will rejected everything because everlasting love where all the essential quality begin of life he is the he is the one we call a creator and last mean everlasting in internal life your love long to god you will be never compromise thank you so much prophet said khan our next question is how a mankind can establish a oneness with god please explain about it. thank you so much if my people who are called by my name humble themselves seek my face pray and open their heart and make them empty turn their wicked way i will hear from heaven forgive their sin and heal their land it mean there are four keys this is a preparing like a warm up the journey for god Every time in the human history God never left mankind alone. So now final goal is of human history to establish the kingdom of God on earth substantial. Last day mean that evil world will pass away and new idol will take ideal world will take place. Now hear the voice of God the first thing what they can do that god is again revealing and speaking to mankind that final goal to settle down with mankind is here god want to be visible god for men for mankind and we are offering god the wine secret to fellow men so the first step is they have to read our books second then they should ask what kind of journey we should take place and we will guide them all this is a oneness of god so we are living a very 21 century is a very special century of god 
and we must not, we should not miss this opportunity. Otherwise, the providence of God gonna move to second generation, and they will be better people who will better listen. The will of God, and they will take a better journey for the will of God. Thank you so much, Prophet Zahid Khan. Uh, in one of our previous uh, program, as uh, you have mentioned, the uh, six keys which God has given to you, uh, in fact, to all mankind, including prophets and messiahs. So, please tell us more detail about those keys. How those six keys? work in human life uh, how should we use those six keys to establish the oneness with god thank you so much number one when you turn this when you turn on the car and engine engine is on <coughs> this is your body so when you bow in the body, in this position, a body feel taste, and your body you do not want to stand up and remain in this bow position. Then you have taken care of the wild horse, and you are qualified to ride this wild horse actually. But then, if mind, which is a rider is follow in this bow position in true thinking of God and every else thinking left behind like leave the world behind you and then you have adjust with your body when your consciousness is taking care of your mind because your mind is now in the true thinking of God, then your consciousness bring peace inside of yourself. And after your conscious, which we call <coughs> Samir, is ready to bow with in this position and spiritual world open for you your blindness go away and you can see the spiritual light, life beyond the death. Okay? So you are ready to travel in the dimension of truth, which are mostly dimension of angel. They are going to guide you. And if your emotion, your heart, is also bow in this position and make empty itself, because heart... 110% belong to God. And your emotion, your first and last love become belong to God and you reject to compromise anything else when someone take you away from God, then you bow your heart and fulfill the purpose. Okay. Another spear, uh, key is your spirit. The love of God produced the light which make you universal, free, and give you the key for the internal life. And the last key is the will of God. Then. And if you cannot do the will of God and confrontation with the society and do not deliver what God is revealing to you, then your all key are good for nothing. It's just like a plane is ready to take off but you cannot take off it from the runway. And number last after this is the will of God will decide which mention, which dimension you are belong to actually. If my people who are called by my name humble themselves, seek my face, pray.
pray and open their heart and make them empty. Thank you so much, uh, Prophet Zaid Khan, for such an amazing answer and uh, incredible details how to use those six keys. Uh, our last question of this transmission uh, would be the next one. Thank you so much, Prophet Zahid Khan. Our last question is, is there any easiest way for any individual, I must say the mankind, that they can unlearn everything what they have learned through their whole life? I mean, they have so many beliefs, different cultures, different backgrounds and different mindsets. How can anyone just unlearn, stop everything right there and experience what you are offering in spirituality? Is there any easy way that somebody can reach to that point that, okay, he is ready to use those keys and why he should use those keys? Why it is important for them? Sorry, I add two questions in uh, one message. Thank you so much. Yes, my dear prophet. Easiest way is like a 2000 year ago, Jesus was saying, Kingdom of God is in your hand, not in God's hand. It will depend on you if you respond to the Kingdom of God. You're going to make it. But if you reject it, the Kingdom of God is a pain and suffering in human history for mankind and now let's come to the point very easy way because steering of heart is in your hand your goal of mankind is to come to know God and build their relationship so you just your standing into God's sight <clears throat> and it will be everything will be very easy this world old world gonna be behind you but your problem is our problem is nay, our problem is is not our problem this is this religious problem they are hanging with this their prophet they are hanging with this teaching not knowing the teaching just putting the Holy Quran in the hand and saying we have the solution but by themselves they are blind. They are not going inside of this teaching to realization but only holding for salvation and living in the old world backs. So they are making many crimes against humanity, against their children, against their fellow men. So simple way is, here is your hand, there is a motor is on, here is your heart, turn the steering to your heart and say, who is the first who should receive my love and who is the purpose of life? Turn this direction. But the, 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 what caused the suffering of these religious people, they put God behind and they are turning their uh, staring to their prophet and they are turning to believe blindly that they are going to bring them into paradise this is all of the issue which caused them to end up in the lower world thank you thank you so much uh, prophet Zahid Khan for your very special time and incredible spiritual guidance what you are giving to the mankind uh, and uh, we are thankful to our admin team and all members who has paid attention to listen to our program uh, is there any possibility that uh, if you have more time we can take you to our next uh, Urdu transmission chat group called Satche Lamhat Khuda Ke Saath please let us know thank you so much Yeah, in Pakistan, <clears throat> in their paradises, still light is off. Amazing, what kind of paradise they are living? No life, no light. 
people are suffering there is the worst nightmare going on in their country and this islamic republic is paradise on earth god protect us from such a religion actually yeah let's go on the other other, other side two moment with god uh, thank you so much uh, uh, prophet uh, zaid khan the heart of the god and the uh, messiah of the all eternities we take you from now on to our next chat group called sachilamath khuda ke sath welcome you there see you now thank you so much